Welcome back to 1700 with Amy and Jean. We're with Melina, Evelyn and Onik. Welcome, guys. Hello, guys. Hello. How are you going? Very well, thank Good, you. Thank Melina, you. you're from the States. I am. I'm from Austin, Texas. Austin Ooh. and Onik, you're from here. Yes, I'm <laughs> born in the UK, but I came here many years ago. Okay, so we'll I'm Australian we'll now. Claim yeah. you. <laughs> claim <laughs> me, claim you. Claim me, please. We'll have you now. Um, how'd you guys meet? Tell us about how you collaborated. Okay, it's a bit of an interesting story. So um, there's, I'm not sure if you guys may be aware, there's a Facebook page called uh, Melbourne Musicians. Oh. And when Melina first came, or just about when she came to Melbourne, she posted on there being like, hey guys, wanna make friends and know where good places to gig and that kind of thing. And I thought she was really nice, really sweet. So I just decided to follow her life after that. And then it, it got to a point where I uh, posted a video of my own on my Onik page. And then Melina commented, is this you? Like, are you real? Yeah, because yeah. she thought I was a stock image yeah, or something. Oh, really? I did actually. Yeah. Why, what was the image that made you think of uh, it? I, used, I do uh, photography as well, so my pictures. Uh, he just looked very like nice. robotic. Uh, like yeah. <laughs> you, if you go on Onyx's Facebook page, I absolutely 100% agree with you. Yeah, like, so like, beautiful. It, it, it's, like, yeah, yeah. I, you're so stunningly Thank beautiful you. that oh, it, it, you're almost not human. Okay, I'll take that. Thank you. No, it's fantastic. As long as I'm not the only one that thought that. Okay, okay cool. Um, so you guys just got together through Facebook? Basically, basically. Yeah, yeah. At the so end we, of the day. We, we had some chats over the Facebook and just talked about different topics and talked about guns and <laughs> other sorts of uh, topics. And I just learned, I didn't have any American friends, so just knowing about what was going on there was quite interesting for me. And um, then later I was um, needing to record something for an assignment I was doing. And um, I knew Melina, so I thought, okay, I'll give this a go. And so we just organized a collaboration, which turned out to be the track Glue. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then that moved on to the video as well, which we'd worked together on. Yeah, so it's like I got a recording out of it and he got help with his school project. So. Yeah, so it's a win-win situation. So Absolutely. symbiotic. It, um, is, it really worked. Yeah, so can you guys tell us a little bit about Glue? Obviously you're about to release it and we will be playing it right after this, by the way. Tell us a little bit about Glue. Um, it's just a song that, it's like the only song actually that I've written here. So um, it's just kind of about relationships, mm -hmm. I guess. Not necessarily one in particular, mm -hmm. just, um, yeah, just kind of people who are together and maybe one not wanting to be with them and the other one not really accepting that so, so yeah just kind of it's your work in terms of um the song content writing. songwriting it is yeah and you were you were the producer yes. of the clip and, uh, yeah. and the song itself that's correct yes okay. yeah yeah Great. so melina approached me with the the rough demo and we just had a few uh late night meetings at starbucks talking about mm -hmm. the the track and then potentially a video as well and um i was really moved just because the music i tend to work on tends to be uh, quite busy and quite loud so i thought got stripping that all back to natural sort of organic layers was a challenge for me but it was one i was willing to take and it worked out really well okay fantastic well um i'm excited let's have a look um, and we'll uh, continue talking with you guys when we come back. Mm -hmm. um, let's have a look at the clip yeah. and see what it's all about. This is Glue. Hey, and welcome back to 1700 with Melina and Onik. Now, we just watched the debut of their click, Glue, which was so, so, so good. We were talking about it the whole time. We absolutely loved it. Now, mm -hmm. we uh, obviously like the clip, so I think it was a bit of a long process, you know, making it. So, how long did it take? What was that process like? Probably took like a month, yeah. like a month and a half. It was, yeah, like we were saying earlier, it was just kind of difficult because we both had such differing schedules. So getting together and just kind of taking the time to do the video and like make sure that everyone gets in one place at one time. Yeah. So yeah, probably like a month and a half, but you did most of the production, so you it probably know better. Long. Yeah, yeah <laughs> you, you starred in it, you yeah. directed it, and you edited it all yeah. together. Yeah. Was that a bit of a time yeah. commitment? Uh, commitment. Sorry. Oh, certainly. Yeah, yeah. It definitely was. It, it was um, also quite challenging. I'm used to s um, being on both sides of the camera, yeah. but mm. it was. Al it's also kind of like a, a different world, and you have to change. Like you have to switch your brain, like as to which role you're taking. Yeah. yeah. Um, it was. We we're saying off air. It's so uniquely Melbourne. Yeah. Amy and definitely. I both from Melbourne. Yeah. You're from Adelaide. You're from Austin. So I mean, it's kind of ironic, but we haven't really seen a video clip which is just so, so really Melbourne yeah, and it's fantastic. Yeah. Um, do you feel like it represents Melbourne from the time that, the short time that you've been here? I think it does, especially like the green tram thing that passed by. That is something that I've never... <laughs> <laughs> green tram. Uh, that's something we just don't have The land submarine. Yeah, and that's like when I think <laughs> of 
Melbourne now. That's what I'm gonna always just remember is just those things all over the place. Yeah. <laughs> I was even saying that like the sound at the very end of the clip is like a, a distorted uh, sound of the tram as yeah. well. <laughs> so the tram is always with you. Really. I think it's cool that we did that idea because since we're not from here, when we both go our separate ways or wherever we are in the future, I'll always remember Melbourne and yeah. just kind of what I saw during that year. Yeah, yeah, so it's the best take home present you could yeah. probably Absolutely. get yeah. anyone or yeah. take home yeah, with you. Nice it's packing. the best memorabilia you could have. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Um, so obviously there's a couple of landmarks you chose to put in there. So you had the Shrine of Remembrance, trams, trains, all of that. Why the decision to have those certain things in the clip? I think just because, like I said, when I think of Melbourne, those are the things that I first did when I arrived here. Yeah, they come like the trams and the shrine. <laughs> I was always because I live in St Kilda, so I'm always just passing, passing these things. And um, I also thought they were like you do live in St Kilda. I do. We, we didn't see Luna Park. We didn't see Kanye Garden. Yeah, <laughs> we didn't see the beach. We didn't get that far. <laughs> like, are you north of the Yarra? Are Pardon. you north of the Yarra? Yes. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. Yeah. So a nice equilibrium. It's a draw the line. Yeah. 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 Fair enough. <laughs> but I would have loved to have Luna Park. Like, yeah. I would have loved that, but it just wasn't in the cards for that. Mm -hmm. Oh, we love that. Um, also, obviously, it's the first time you've collabed together. Can we see another collaboration in the future? I must say, this project was really strung together with a lot of luck and just good timing. Yeah. So hopefully, if the stars align again, I'd definitely love to work with Melina again on something. I feel like I've learned so much working yeah. with such a different artist. So definitely, yes, but depends on time and luck and everything. Mm. We were thinking about maybe a five song EP, four song EP, yeah. but like he said, yeah, it just depends on where we are. Maybe Sydney, Adelaide, Brisbane, yeah. Yeah. Melbourne. And Austin. <laughs> yes, yes. I think we need like Luna Park in the next one now. I would, would love like to have Luna Park, dollars. yeah. <laughs> okay, fantastic. Well, Melina's going to stick around and perform for us. Thanks for coming on, Onik. Um, yes, thank we're you. We're going to go to a clip Thanks. and a break, and you'll come back and perform the acoustic version.